Hello friends, uh, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Saurabh Chhabra and uh, today we will be discussing about uh, Terraform. So if you find this uh, video useful, so please like, share and um, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Okay, so let's just get started. So I want to discuss about uh, Terraform, right? Mm -hmm. In my previous video, I showed you the end part, what is the desired state. But uh, this is the introduction and I will be creating few series out of uh, Terraform where I would be uh, creating new videos where I would be discussing about how to create, what to create and what is uh, you know, uh, the way to uh, get the automation done, right? So let's, let's, let's start with the definition, what, what exactly Terraform is. Well, uh, Terraform is uh, infrastructure as a code software which is used to you know uh, deploy your infrastructure through the code itself the the software itself which is from hashicorp company okay and this software is used to build change and verify your infrastructure so this particular software can be used to create your uh, to build your infrastructure and to have nominal changes so it would be an incremental changes so whenever you start deploying your infrastructure you can use terraform and then you once you build on to your infrastructure you can change it accordingly and have the incremental build as as part of your ci cd pipeline or if you are doing it from from outside right so you can you can deploy uh, your infrastructure from a command line like uh, uh, command prompt or for that matter powershell or git bash or anywhere right so you can deploy and verify your infrastructure so if there is no changes in your infrastructure you you can verify that as well so this this particular uh, you know software allows us to do to build change verify your in existing infrastructure or to build a new one the the cloud uh, i mean it is it is supporting all major clouds um, you, you can have uh, aws azure gcp oracle ibm and there are lot many more uh, uh, you know major cloud providers which are supported for terraform and you can use terraform to deploy your uh, infrastructure so it's a basically a, a, a infrastructure build tool right so yeah so yeah, it's 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 uh, I mean it's a deployment tool which supports major cloud. The other thing is that it is using a high level language which is called HCL, which which is HashiCorp configuration language, and uh, it's a very very simple language. Uh, I I bet it's, it's 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 the simplest language which which you can you can ever learn. So uh, it's it's kind of your it's a declarative language. You you declare key value pair right so it's a very easy even e easy than your yaml code so yeah let's just uh, let's just show you what all the uh, you know files that are created uh, when when we are uh, deploying stuff so first of all it's the main.tf file uh, it's it's kind of a code file where you have your uh, whole code into it so i would be discussing about about um, the the files in my uh, uh, upcoming videos uh, in detail so you can just view about what what all the files are required uh, so this is the main tf file everything can be uh, in one file and you can still deploy your infrastructure but as per the you know uh, standards what we do is we we create few files and we create modules and then we deploy our infrastructure out of it right so this is the main uh, tf file which we create as part of your code uh, which which you deploy so there's another file which is a variable file variable file is a file where you declare all your variables you declare the type of variables or you can have a hard coded uh, uh, you know uh, uh, you can hard coded value here but you can have default value here so whatever uh, this is this is uh, the variable uh, you know variable dot file so all the files which are part of um, the um, the terraform usually have dot uh, tf extension to it but some of the files like terraform dot tf files which is uh, which is kind of a uh, file which is used for hard coding your exact value if you can see here location is equal to center india 
uh, hub rg is equal to the the rg name right so these are the this is the file where you declare your uh, actual hard code um, you know names of of your variable so in in the previous in the previous slide i show you the variable right here you define the variable like right? location would be type string here where you def uh, define your uh, the names so uh, i'm not going deep into it currently on, on this introduction video it's just that i just wanted to uh, you know show you what what we actually do while we deploy stuff right so this is the tf var files the other file is provided to your tf this is this is where you declare your provider right which uh, cloud provider you would be working on so currently I have, i'm working on azure so i will be showing you azure provider so you can type in aws gcp whatever um, this would be a provider file which is uh, which is used to uh, you know declare what kind of uh, what uh, cloud vendor you are you're gonna you're gonna use right so this is this is another file which is the output file so once you deploy your infrastructure it basically gives you the output and what what whatever output do you need it it will it will um, you know uh, have uh, have it uh, 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 output there so uh, this is the value and again key value pair so this is if if the your uh, the infrastructure is deployed this is this is what it will come the hub rg name is this right so yeah the next next uh, files is the tf state file this is a very important file so once you deploy stuff into into azure or any other cloud so this is the state of your infrastructure this is a json format file where it will it will define your infrastructure and whenever there is a change or a new value is created this is where uh, terraform uh, refer back and uh, i would be discussing about more of the uh, tf state file which where do you keep it uh, how do you manage it in, in my in my upcoming videos so and and this is tf uh, state backup file which is kind of a backup of your tf state file so yep yeah, so these are the basic files that, that we do have in, in terraform if you are familiar with these files you're familiar with terraform right so yeah uh, so yeah this is your introduction to terraform and uh, thank you thank you very much i would be creating new videos and i would be uh, up updating so stay tuned thank you